So apprenticeships are work-based qualifications, so predominantly they are done in the working environment. The assessors come out to the workplace, they give you assessments to carry out, they do observations of your, your daily duties and things that you do at work. Um, also, they set you work for the next visit when they come out, so there isn't that additional need to come into college. I chose to do an apprenticeship because I thought it would be better than being in a classroom all day and you get to learn a lot more when you're out and about. It helps you for your future really, you learn how to manage your money, you get your wage, it goes into your bank, you get to learn a lot more from that side of things. My boss has been brilliant, he's from start to finish, if you ever need anything he's always there. We get a lot of support from college, we get visits every two or three weeks, you have your paperwork sent to you, you get constant updates on how you're getting on. If you're ever stuck there's always someone at the end of the phone. Well I think being an assessor from my previous experience of being a nurse means I can see people in the care industry who sometimes haven't had any education and it's about giving them the advice and the guidance to complete an award that they would never have. Most of the time you're out here serving food and it's nice because everybody's smiling and it's usually a happy, nice place to be. Well, my college assessor's brilliant actually. Like, yeah, she, she's very helpful with the work. If I have any questions, she's always there to ask and uh, she knows exactly what she's doing. Yeah, I plan to stay on out to do caring, um, maybe move to the MVQ level 3. So I plan to stick to it for a long time, maybe move into social care aspects of it. SBCC, Bernardo's is what I will eventually go on to. The benefits of an apprenticeship are um, that they get to work towards a qualification that's nationally recognised while also being able to earn a wage and work for an employer that is um, in the industry that they're interested in. The apprenticeship framework um, consists of the main aim qualification which is based on your sector specific um, qualification so if you choose business admin then you'll do a, a diploma that's sort of suited to that sector and then you have your functional skills which is your maths and English with some you have to do your ICT as well. Also you do your um, technical certificate and you do your employability skills as well. I like being an assessor because it gives me the opportunity to be out in the workplace um, working with the students in a profession that I've done all my life. Yeah, the apprentices really enjoy their time um, working as an apprentice. They very often follow from their apprenticeship into a full-time career, quite often at the placement where they've been during their apprenticeship. Um, well, I chose to do an apprenticeship because uh, the opportunity I found in the newspaper and I thought, well, that's something that I can do. I've never done that before. I thought I'd love to find out what kind of route that's like. It's a qualification that I can keep with me for life under my belt and I'll actually be working at the same time and learning about, at the same time, what I will be doing. My uh, assessor, she's fantastic. I love her to pieces. And again, uh, that's such a nice, calm atmosphere. And uh, I love it when she comes around. I would definitely recommend doing an apprenticeship because you're kind of learning outside just the bog standard um, units and the syllabus, you know, you're learning so much beyond that. Apprenticeships are aimed at um, anybody over the age of 16 wanting to, to sort of work rather than going into full-time education. It takes at least 12 months for um, an apprenticeship, that's the minimum amount of time that you can spend on apprenticeship and it can go anywhere between that and 24 months um, depending on the needs of the learner, um, the speed that they work at and you know all the bits and bobs that are involved in the actual qualification itself. We work really closely with the employers and the apprentices to ensure that they both get um, everything they need from the qualification, that they're both getting the support and guidance that they need to help them through the apprenticeship programme. When I started, my boss really wanted me to be um, trained thoroughly. Um, it started with even just washing cars, you know, he wanted them washing in a certain way, he wanted me to do everything in a certain way, um, and that included then when I began to service cars. I think it's really important that, um, that I have been trained properly. I enjoy working with my hands and um, doing physical jobs. I've always done physical jobs. Um, and I, I do find it hard sitting in a classroom, although I do enjoy learning as well. You know, I'm, I'm really glad that I've chosen this route and the learning that I've achieved through it and the skill base that I've achieved through it, I don't think I could have done it any other way.